In this video, we shall see what is scalar, what is vector and what is tensor. So if we see scalar from our school level basics, we know physical quantity that is denoted by a single real number or we can say it is having some magnitude but no direction. For example, temperature, density, mass, they, sing, they can be expressed in some magnitude, some number, but they cannot have a direction. So they are denoted by alpha, beta, gamma and scalars are zeroth rank tensors. Uh, but we cannot say all uh, the scalars as zeroth rank tensors. Uh, they have uh, 3 power 0 as rank is 0, 3 power 0 will be having one component. So scalar can be represented by one number. So if we see the vector, vectors are physical quantities that is, repre uh, that is represented by both magnitude and direction. So for example, force, position and velocity. So they will be having some magnitude and direction which they are passing. So these are denoted by small bold, uh, cap uh, small bold alphabetical uh, letters U, V, W, R. Uh, so this can be represented uh, also to show the vector it is uh, u arrow v arrow w arrow vectors are first rank tensor or rank one tensors but uh, we cannot say all the uh, rank one tensors as vectors uh, so they have three power one that is three components so vector can be denoted by a to a a1 a to a3 or uh, x y z we can represent a b small a b c is okay and i j k so we can represent tensor in these ways dr so this is the tensor so whenever we say tensor so in general that is a second order tensor so that is also known as dr a dr is uh, can be called as a tensor of rank 2 and it has 3 power 2 so whatever the rank is there so that uh, the power of 2 uh, so power of 3 will be uh, that number of components so rank 2 tensor so it is found three, uh, having components 3 power 2 that is equal to 9 components it has magnitude and it two directions so for example stress tensor and it is represented like this so it has nine components so 3 by 3, three multiplied by 3 nine components so another one we have to see what is triad so triad can be cal called as a tensor of rank 3 and it has a magnitude and three directions so it has 3 power 3 because rank 3 so it has 27 components so these are the components it will be having so here you can see uh, just a minute. Uh, you can see this uh, it is having this a11 a12 a13 a21 a22 a23 a31 a32 a33 so those are so if you come downwards so that is having just okay these are one two three so these are uh, in downward direction uh, this is the first component so second component if you see one a one one a one two a one three so second component is increasing in horizontal direction so this is second number second index and in this way so if you see a one 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 a one two one a one three one if you see the a one 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 a one one two a one two two a one three two so in this way the third index is changing okay this is third index so it has 27 components so this is 9 plus 9 plus 9 so this is just like a rubik's cube a rubik's cube uh, so just like rubik's cube it is having all the components as 27 so that is simple uh, introduction about uh, vectors scalars and tensors we will talk something in our uh, next video thanks for your time